terrifying secret revealed about the migrant caravan America must prepare. The Department of Homeland Security has a warning concerning the oncoming migrant caravan. And Americans should be extremely concerned. Thousands of people in the migrant caravan are seeking asylum but for the most part, the migrants aren't that desperate. They keep saying they are fleeing poverty and looking for work, yet the majority of them have cell phones, a luxury that many Americans living in poverty cannot afford to have. Furthermore, border authorities have already said that most of these migrants don't qualify for asylum in the U.S. But now. DHS has made a disturbing discovery that goes well beyond fraudulent asylum claims. From Western Journal The migrant caravans heading for the U.S. border have more than 500 criminals within them, according to Homeland Security officials. During a conference call with reporters, officials said most of the caravan members are not women and children Fox News reported. Officials said that although women and children pushed to the front of the group to get sympathy, most migrants are young males. The truth the media doesn't want you to know, right here. The fact that the caravan is filled with mostly men who have criminal backgrounds is hardly surprising. The young males in this caravan have already demonstrated criminal behavior by attacking our border agents with rocks and trying to tear down our border fence. But DHS is not taking these criminals lightly, and have reinforced many parts of the fence with rows of razor wire. This is a border wall with row upon row of concertina wire DHS Secretary Christian Nielsen said. Make no mistake we are very serious. You will not get it.